Hello guys, welcome to Python Freaks. So in this video, we are going to discuss about language. What is language? Before moving to any programming language, you should know what is language. So language is the mode of communication between two person or body. So person can exchange the idea between them. Okay. Now language has two types. One is natural language. Another one is formal language. So natural language is if person is talking with person two. So person is exchanging the idea with person two. So that is called natural language. Like Hindi, English. French and so on. So all these languages are coming inside natural language. Okay. For example, he is running. So here he is the object, or we can say it's a subject, right? In your grammar, in English grammar, this is the subject, and this one is the action. So he is performing this action. So we are getting some knowledge, or we are able to predict it. Okay, he is running. Okay, like that. So whenever you are going to make any programming language, then you have to consider all these things. Now, second type is formal language. In formal language, we have two scenarios. So, in formal language, first, if we are doing some computationals, then we need formal language. So, that scenario is if person wants to talk with device, then we have to design some language that is called formal language. And if device is communicating with device, that is also coming inside formal language. Okay. So first scenario is person is talking with device, or device is talking with person. It can be like that also. Okay. That is high level language. High level language means person can understand this language easily. Or device also can understand it. Okay. Let's see Java, Python, and so on. So these languages are coming inside high level language. Okay. Then scenario is device is talking with other device. That scenario is called low level language. We can't directly send the English words to device one to device two, so it will be converted into one zero four. Some sequence will become like that. Okay, then device can communicate with each other. So these scenarios are coming inside formal language. So for that we have some syntax, semantics, tokens, and all these things. I will not discuss briefly here. So these are the things we have to consider when we are going to make any programming language or we are going to learn the programming language. So then, so this is the category of formal language. Now, two parameters are there which we have to consider when we are going to make any programming language or learn it. So ambiguity. Ambiguity means one word. has more than two or two meaning okay if any word having two or more than two meaning that means it is ambiguous in english if i am talking about kite kite is a word it has two meanings okay so that is ambiguous if i am talking about formal language in formal language less ambiguity should be there means if you have a word 
it should be only one meaning, not more than two or two. So we can relate like that. Formal language is less ambiguous with natural language. Okay? So ambiguity is the less in formal language. Now redundancy will come to the picture. So in redundancy, any word should be more concise, right? So for that, formal language is also a less redundant with natural language. So this is the scenario we have to consider whenever we are going to make any new programming language. You can create its own, okay? And you want to learn it, then you can learn it. So we are coming with the Python series. It will be divided into three parts. So first part, you can create your desktop application or networking application using database. SQLite here I will cover. And then in second series, you can be able to create your web applications. So Django and Fast I will cover in this series. And then in third series, I will cover Python with data structure. So generally in interview questions will be asked from data structure so you can be easily given the answer from data structure this series. Okay, if you like my video, please like, share, comment and for more videos, please subscribe. Thanks.